Thank you very much. How are you guys feeling today? Yeah? Awesome. Well, my name is Pete Lee. Um, it's, it's impossible for me to be tough because my name has four E's in it. My name sounds like the horn of a moped. It's like, Pete Lee. <laughs> <laughs> my name sounds like if a moped had a really sissy car alarm, you know, like, Pete Lee, Pete Lee, Pete Lee. Whoops, whoops. Pansy, pansy, pansy. Weak, weak, Pete. <laughs> Yeah, my parents might as well name me Okie Dokie. <laughs> or in Spanish, Okie Dokie. <laughs> I, um, oh my gosh. I do have a girlfriend, you know? Um, and it's weird when I say that, people stare at me the way that you people are staring at me right now. Like, she's probably imaginary. <laughs> when we first started dating, all my buddies were like, hey Pete, where's this girlfriend of yours? I was like, dude, she travels all around the world for work, all right? They're like, yeah, so does Santa. <laughs> And my girlfriend's name is Jamie, which that doesn't help me be more manly than my girlfriend has a dude's name, you know? Why do you parents keep naming your adorable little daughters dude's names? Because sissies like me date them. We're going to be like, hey, this is my girlfriend, Travis. <laughs> you know? So she started giving me, me a cool nickname. Like, she nicknamed me Pumpkin Butter Butt. <laughs> yeah, so I nicknamed her Sarah. <laughs> That's a real girl's name. I, um, I'm so mad at Sarah right now, though, uh, because uh, about a year ago, she bought me a shirt. It had a house on it with a circle around it. I had no idea. What, I thought it was a cool band. I was like, check it out. It's my Circle House shirt. Awesome. No clue what it was until yesterday. My best friend goes, no, dude, that's home. Oh. He's like, you're a circle house, dude. <laughs> I was wondering why men kept buying me mojitos. <laughs> I was like, thank you, Sip. <laughs> I mean, look at me. It's not like I need to look like any more of a sissy. I'm about as tough as a mustache on a blonde guy. <laughs> Sorry, blonde guy. I, uh... Have you ever seen a blonde guy trying to rock the mustache solo? He's like, girl, I'm a biker. It's like, no, dude, you're a cyclist. <laughs> I, um, I just moved though, I grew up in Wisconsin, I moved from Wisconsin, Wisconsin? Ooh, that's weird, I didn't know if you said woo or moo. <laughs> we have a lot of cows there. I, um, but no, I just moved from Wisconsin to New York City because I wanted to get in touch with my inner jerk. And um, it's, <laughs> thank you. I, uh, but no, it's totally not working out for me because every time I try to act like New York tough, like the Midwestern nice seeps back into me and I totally wimp out and I back down, you know, I'll be like, I'm gonna stab you in the face. Then I'll take you to the hospital. <laughs> Kiss my butt, sir. <laughs> you want me to get your sister pregnant. Then, you know, just like be there for her. <laughs> But I'm celebrating, because uh, last Friday officially was my last day of my day job, man. I'm a full-time, yeah, thank you. Yeah, all right, you can clap, yeah. All right, yeah, yeah. Here's the funny part, is I haven't told my job yet. <laughs> I'm just gonna let them figure it out on their own, <laughs> all right? Told my dad that, he's like, you can't do that, you gotta give them two weeks notice. I was like, no, how about I give them two weeks to notice? <laughs> yeah. My girlfriend, man, um, I love her so much, but um, aside from dressing me weird, she, um, she's kind of materialistic, you know, she's all about money. We go on this date the other night, the first thing she says to me, no kiss, hello, no nothing, she goes, well, I don't see how much money you can spend tonight, mister. <laughs> yeah, so I took her to a strip club. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm Peely. Thanks for being a great crowd. Thank you very much. Oh.